and then I have 50. I have 48 on this side and 50 on this side. Do you think people will actually think this 50 will be on the same level as others, considering you know he's 0 and 0 as a boxer? Um. I can't overlook Conor McGregor. I can't. I can't. You know, that's what happens a lot of time. A lot of times in sports, we get caught slipping. We get caught sleeping. You know, I can't sleep on this guy. I mean, he's like I said before. He he proved himself, and he got here somehow, some way. It's obvious he was doing something right to get to this point. And you mentioned in the presser that you couldn't have done this alone that he has a lot to do with this promotion I, yeah, of course i don't, I don't want to you know i don't want to rain on his parade but it all started with me it all started with me you know i was able to put this event together but i gotta take my hat off to the fans the boxing fans and the mma fans the fans coming together to make this event happen. Not, so is not this, a lot of love for you though in there uh, earlier when we saw when we were all the all the jeers so, tell me uh, about that sweetheart i'm floyd mayweather and, and they know my middle name is Money. So I choose fortune over fame. And a lot of people like to choose fame. You know, what's the use of having a, a, multi a multi million dollar face with no money in your pocket? So we believe in, I believe in having a ton of money and nobody knowing me and making smart investments and living a comfortable life. Because you gotta realize this I can sit at home every day and live a great life to the casket drop. The, the fight against Pacquiao didn't deliver to expectations because Pacquiao wasn't, he wasn't able to deliver. I don't, what makes this fight it's, it's, even it's, better than that? Well, um, Conor McGregor is going to deliver. He's going to come out and fight hard. I truly believe so. I just know he's going to come out. I mean, he's upset. I think I pushed his buttons today. You know, I said that. <laughs> you, usually, you usually don't say you're going to knock somebody out, but today you did. Well, is, no, is no, this... no. Before my, my body broke down. Before my body broke down, because remember, before my body broke down, I had probably a, what, 80% knockout ratio. I knocked there, I was knocking everybody out. So, you know, that was before my body broke down. Um, my body had a chance to sit for two years and uh, and hopefully heal, you know, from from all those grueling fights in the past. So we'll just see, you know, fight night, you know, what I go out there and do. So yeah, what would have been like these? five years ago if you would have faced him five years ago with him at, at the top of his game? Um, I don't really know. I don't. I can't really say. Um, he gonna come out there and fight his ass off. I truly believe so.